I have been starting a tour of the county and the cities uh, with our executive director to talk about the issue of raising the of the sales tax cap exemption. I want to get this right. Uh, that our senator has requested us to get a show of support from the cities and towns around Marin for the legislation that he is willing to introduce for us. Uh, the TAM board uh, last month in December directed the staff to send letters of support from each jurisdiction. And this is the effort that we are carrying out right now. What has surfaced, uh, and it may not be a surprise, is um, a challenge in understanding the, the, the process <coughs> going forward and how this legislative uh, initiative is needed in addition to the sales tax uh, uh, expenditure plan. So uh, we'll go forward uh, in February with a process memo that will make clear to everyone how we're going to go forward with the legislative item and the expenditure plan development so that the cities and towns and the county can take comfort that we have a plan, we'll have a list of projects that will come before both all the cities and towns and this board as well as the public and everyone will have a chance to weigh in and most importantly everyone will have a chance to vote on this in the future. So uh, I, I just want to say we've heard I think all of us on this board for years a cry for more transportation and transit projects and services. As you probably know, our Measure A sales tax is fairly fully committed at this point to transit operations and other ongoing operations and maintenance. So if we want to take on larger projects in the future, highway construction, interchange improvements, finishing the Marin Sonoma Narrows, uh, it's important that we ha be able to have a conversation about what it would take to undertake those kinds of projects. So. That's what this effort is about.